On one hand, we are seeking for federating states to have uh, autonomy. We want regional government to return. We want uh, to, to, to actually have true federalism. On the other hand, we are celebrating using a federal high court city in Abuja to stop the CBN from um, um, paying local government funds into um, the state account. We are not even saying the local government should even receive the money based on Supreme Court judgment. We are saying that the money should not be simply and keep the money. The same country where we have been saying that we should return to true federalism. You see that we are all deceiving ourselves. And there are people celebrating it to say, Fubara will learn a lesson. And these are the same people that have insisted that they want the system to run like it runs in America. They want the same system to run like it runs in every other part of the country. Every other part of the world, sorry. Unfortunately, there's a federal high court judge in this country that is saying no. Whereas by, by, by the letter, forget about the spirit, by the letter of the Nigerian constitution, we are supposed to have federalism. We are in a federal system of government. By the letter, by the spirit, there are certain other protocols involved. And we that's why we see our state government going to Abuja to collect federal locations from what they can actually have access to the mineral deposit in their, in their state to be able to build and develop their state. We have problems already. But what I will never accept that all of us in this country want this country to get better. We should begin to agree that we have got moles in this country. Of course, fortunately, more than those of us who want this country to get better. And it's okay now for you to say because we don't like we can we like to away. But ask yourself, why will a federal high court sitting in Abuja answer a prayer of a non party? It is not the state of House of Assembly. It is not the local government chairpersons. It is not members of the state executive council. It is not the deputy governor. A no this same court heard prayers of other political parties against Shetima having double nomination prior to the 2023 general elections. And the court said that the PDP were a busy body. A bu that was the language of the court. A busy body. Today, busy body has it come to effect because somebody who is powerful who is increasing salaries by 135%, who is buying SUVs and who is building houses for them, is being tossed. They have tossed the tail of a tiger. The fact remains that we don't have a country. We don't! The country where Wiki has the judiciary in his breast pocket, he tossed it at his will. A couple of years ago, and then that's where I began to notice there's a problem. It was an ugly trend. I think prior to 2020, 2020 I do elections. Well, Court judgment from Kano were coming to halt and stop electoral processing in those states. Say, so, well, I was told that Grand Tuji at that time was being used. Since Wiki got to Abuja, if you want to stop anything in this country, call Wiki. Nothing. There is nothing you have to tell me. And then we are clapping. A busy body, a former governor. Is boastful enough to say, he said I would do it, and he did it. Won't bitters all of you. God punish all of you that has kept this country prepared, that do not want this country to progress beyond, beyond the framework that we see. In Dalai, my no forms of crisis. I can never imagine. Ah, Marco. We want true federalism. We want federating states. We want federating states, federating units to have powers. We want them to have autonomy. We want them to become productive. We don't want to live in a country where the central government still controls everything. There is a federal court in Abuja. We interfere in the running of the state. CBN, stop. See, I don't know whether this is going to work or not, but I'm bothered that we've lost it. It's, it's getting bad though, it's getting worse. And like my friend call it Peter, he said there's no there's no rock bottom again anymore in this country. There's no rock bottom. It gets it, when you think it is ending, it starts again. There is an evolution, there is a modulation, there's a transposition. It goes again, it goes deeper. There's no rock bottom. From the police now to the ethnic, now to the judiciary. We don't have a country. We'll all of you.